This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment and educational purposes only. And anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube album stuff. So you get the videos that I put them out. So you know I'm thinking, see I'm analyzing that data. But like I tell every day, the data they release us is false. It meant to give us a false narrative of the market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, I was on the phone with a buddy of mine yesterday. And he had told me that he ordered the Tesla Y. And he ordered that, you know, the extra three, the extra three seats in the back. Because it's two, three, three. Yeah, the extra three seats in the back. And that it was going to be delivered, I think, October 1st or something like that. And then he got into the fact that he was going to be able to get a $7,500 EV tax break on the vehicle. And I was like, whoa, so that really reduces the price of the vehicle. So then I told him, I said, but Mullen sells EV vehicles and they don't have that $7,500 EV tax credit. And he said, well, maybe the federal government doesn't consider MULN a real EV car company. And I was taken aback by his response. I didn't know how to answer because... He was entitled to the $7,500 tax credit, but I didn't see that where Mullen buyers were entitled to the same $7,500 EV tax credit. Then today, I get up and I find out that Mullen has been approved to get the EV $7,500 federal tax credit when you buy a Mullen EV vehicle, it is, well, in my opinion, it is great news. I mean, I believe that to be a positive catalyst. It means the United States government is seeing MULN as a true EV car manufacturer. And of course, when I told my boy, he was, he was in shock. He was in shock. That less than 24 hours after we were discussing that $7,500 $7, EV tax credit, that Mullen was approved for the EV tax credit. Anyway, please leave some comments. Tell me what you think. Do you think it's a positive catalyst that Mullen cars are now entitled to this up to $7,500 EV tax credit when anybody purchases a Mullen 